Hey, what up, Long Beach? Welcome back to the562.org. It's Tyler, and this CIF Girls Volleyball highlight is brought to you by the fine folks at Naples Rib Company. All of the 562's volleyball coverage is sponsored by Misty May Trainer and the Dream and Gold Foundation, and all of our Wilson coverage is sponsored by Joel Batonio. Thank you to all of our sponsors. Bruins back at home, round two of the D3 Girls Volleyball playoffs against Serrano. Chloe Prevednikov, are you ready for your season to end today? Yeah, didn't think so. On the other side, the Serrano Diamondbacks, 23-0, and they needed an earlier start time because of a dance tonight. Clearly, preparations are underway. On the other side, they may not have seen a hitter like Alana Smith all year, and she had a big game. She got it going by killing this overpass in the first set, and then behind the line, trying to get them aces. She had a couple of aces in the first game as the Bruins got off to a better start than they did in round one. Then Smith from the back row, too hot to handle. That makes it 18-12 Bruins in the first, forcing a Serrano timeout. Uh, yeah, gotta like what you see so far. Prevednikov, massive swing on the outside. Then Smith again, the pulverizer. She had eight kills and two aces in the first set alone as Wilson was in control. This service error is gonna end that first game. Wilson takes it 25-18. We go upstairs for set two. Bruins got some contributions from senior Grace Domingo. The lefty had three kills in that second set, as this one's going to go right through the defense, just uh, providing another arm uh, to take the pressure off Smith and Prevednikov. Of course, though, Chloe's going to get hers. She's going to take care of that one with ease. She had seven kills in the second set alone, ended up with a dozen for the night. Even when it looked like Serrano did something well with that block, it's going to be a high ball for Chloe. Bang. That's in the student section. Point Wilson. Then Smith going to muscle one down on set point. Another 25-18 set score. And Wilson's up two sets to none. Now in set three, Alana picking up right where she left off in that third set. Determined to sweep this thing. Though Serrano did hang in better in the third. Got some aces to help them stay close. But Smith with the lollipop. That'll drop. Just had to wait a little bit longer. And then, in the middle of the net, the roof! The Vanderwall stands tall as Kate protects the middle of the net. She had a team-high four blocks, did Vanderwall. Serrano, with a block of its own, as the D-backs were able to fight back and tie it at 21 and 22 late in this set. They haven't lost all year, so they're going to make Wilson earn it, and the Bruins would. They'd score the final three points. This one off the antenna is going to set up match point. Sydney Scott, the libero, will serve it. And this swing is going to go well long. Winner, winner, quarterfinal dinner. Wilson hands Serrano their first loss of the season, and they will keep on dancing in these playoffs. The Bruins win 18-18-22. They'll travel to face Edison on Wednesday night in Huntington Beach. Got to thank all of our sponsors, including Ocean Law Center, for their support of local sports coverage. If you want to keep up with these Bruins, the rest of local volleyball, and all other sports in Long Beach, you got to stay tuned right here to the562.org.